and eat all. Your mother was the strongest woman I ever knew. Obi Nibi Okunini. She eat her troubles well from everyone. Despite being her godfather, I couldn't see through her. What does that mean, Daddy OJ? When you both came to America, I knew at that moment I had to protect you. She wanted you away from the family by all means. Don't you have a fair? Auntie, if you can't pay your last respects with sympathy, then you can take your dead flower and leave. <laughs> My dear, there is nothing more satisfying than this moment. <laughs> Benito. This was your mom's. And she would like you to have it. You can't keep running from facts forever, Befe. Eh? Yet for one bow, she'll share bow. You can share me all you want, but just leave my daughter out of it, okay? For mommy, let. Please! Mommy, should I be worried? Because your sister added again? It's nothing to worry about. So tell me, how was your day at court? Did you win? The gubernatorial candidate for the truce party, Honorable Brother Moses, started his campaign and had this to say. Family is what we are all about. To build the nation, to effect the kind of change we all so desperately yearn for, there is a need to... I don't understand what's going on between you and Auntie Abefe. This is such a beautiful family, I wish I could be a part of it. You are a child born with a story, Anita. No, 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 you say this all the time, I'm tired! Because that is all I can say! That's not all you can say, come up with something better, i so much, I want to tell you, but I- There's nothing to talk- <laughs> Mommy, mommy, what, what's wrong? Mommy, are you okay? Ma mommy, ma- <laughs> Thank you, Daddy OJ. You go down. It started with forceful penetrations, which became continuous until I fell pregnant. My family chastised me. It was an abomination, they said. I had to bear the shame alone. I made my choices, one of which was to birth and raise you. I kept you away, Enito, because I couldn't allow them to break you like they did to me. The truth you seek is right in front of you. You see, uh, any time I be any time, kill you, go any time. Any time, that's okay. Has been long disowned by this family mm. years ago. Mm. She committed a grievous abomination, mm -hmm. and she has to face the consequences. Yes. Baba, I'm sorry to say this, but my mother did not commit an abomination. She was raped by someone in this family. And you all ostracized her for it. See, keep salt your mouth. Eh? This is a very prestigious family. And I, I'm sorry, we mm -hmm. forbid you to speak of such abomination again. Don't you know that whatever dies with the dead stays in the grave? You're not in any position to ask questions. Talaroko Jenna! Any toy in your way I talk it. And I promise you, I will unearth the truth behind all of this. Wanoa, Wanoa. I know what. 
That is what we have been trying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What way you are going? Honorable. I'm so so sorry. My name is Anita. Nice to meet you. I'm so sorry. Anita, do I know you? Oh no, my mom is was at Tokyo. You knew her, right? Uh, no, just um, through old stories and some pictures, yeah. Uh, but I'm sorry for your loss. You look teared up. Now be a big girl. Thank you so much. Yes. The truth you seek is right in front of you. I'm quite surprised that you are here, Papa. No, you found your sister despite knowing the truth. You are a shameless and evil human being. Anita, insult me all you want. I don't care. What do you want? Why are you even here? Your husband, the Honorable Almighty, whatever you want to call him, he made the family disown and shame my mother despite knowing the truth. I know he's my father. Anita. I heard that you are a very brilliant lawyer. And I know that it will take a lot of door knocking for you to get sponsors to start up your own practice. So you can have this as a token. There is more where that came from if you can shut your mouth. How did you find out? I wasn't sure it's on now. Oh, that's okay. You've heard from the horse's mouth. And your show told you all that you will do when elected into office. Good times are you! <laughs> At this point, you may now ask your questions. Thank you very much. Um, Yemisi Onobanjo for top news. Honorable. First, I must commend you on your efforts, especially in terms of the bill that opposes domestic violence. But um, I must ask, what would be your take on the bill that seeks to raise the statutes of limitations on a rape case. When elected, the office of the first lady would um, would, would um, seek to pass that bill you just promoted. Honorable, you are such a hypocrite. Some years back, you raped a minor. Preposterous, baseless accusations. Young lady, I hope you are aware of the implications of defamation of character. Yes, I am. My name is Anita. And more than 20 years ago, this man raped my mother. Lies! Ah. She's lying! She's lying! She's lying! She's lying! 
she was just 16. Your wife, Abefa, tormented her till the day that she died. You both deserve to spend the rest of your life behind bars. Why are you letting out to get? And it's all that's finished, You may be my biological father, but I disassociate myself from you. I will always remain any tongue on my attack. Live from the press conference of Honorable Goye Gagbadamosi, an aspirant for the governorship position. Right now, the tables have turned as a young lady just accused the Honorable of raping a minor. <laughs> Okay. Yeah.